but before we start, we are going to have a special opening band. Here is Operations Roots and Culture. Yes, talking about a little bit of reggae, Latino style, you know. Much love and respect to everyone who showed up. Al Delphia and everyone else.
Corporation's Roots and Culture. We are here at our championship round and we have ORC opening up for us. So how did you guys come up with the name Operations Roots and Culture? Well we were looking for a name for for a while. We were coming up with all kinds of stupid corny stuff and one of the first songs we learned the the backbeat kind of dropped out and the singer said this is Operation Roots and Culture and it is kind of an operation because no one we play for has ever heard Roots and Culture music so it's kind of a mission. Yeah like just like the way it's done or the way it's supposed to be done. Uh, who knows how it's supposed to be done? We don't really know. We try our artists and it's reggae is something that you can't like fake you know, like you can't uh, you know, I mean other people try and play reggae and it's like they have a feel but it's not the same it's like they're trying and it's like it's not something you can fake yeah it's like more of a vibe it's all about the vibe they don't bring the vibe it's uh, you know we love the music so much it got to the point where listening to it wasn't enough we had to play it and it just comes from our heart and soul and we just give it our all when we're out there and what inspired you guys to play reggae uh, yeah. Like I said, just, you know, listening to it wasn't enough. Just the love of the music was just so great that, that you know, we had to play it. Just, you know, standing there and singing the songs and yeah. playing with our hands just wasn't cutting it. Yeah. Our, in, our, our influences are mostly, uh, like, old, old Jamaican recordings from We're the 70s Jamaican and 60s. Jamaican. Stuff we got on records and, like, tapes that, you know, Mind just... It? People Things don't you know hear about, of. you know, the old it's Ruth Raddick stuff. You ain't never heard you know, of it. old Bob Marley. <laughs> a lot of old... Uh, stuff from Studio One. All um, right. Old like your grandmama draws, man. I'm talking about. <laughs> now, why don't you guys like give to... everyone your names and then let them know how they can get a hold of you if they want to book you? Start over with Robbie. Uh, my name is Robert Valdez. Uh, you can get a hold of us uh, through um, any. If you see if, if you see us, any one of us on the street or anything like that, go ahead and uh, hey. But other than that, the uh, number is basically 909 659 and uh, I'm the singer. My name's Jason, and I play the drums, and you can get a hold of me at 1-800-SPANK-ME. <laughs> I'm Aaron, I play the bass, um, you know, just, you want to get a hold of us for gigs, the number's 909-623-0659, do anything, parties, weddings, clubs, you name it. Our big thing is bar mitzvahs, though, we're really big in the bar mitzvah scene. Um, right, exactly. But my name's Andy, I play the keys. Um, and this is uh, our new addition right here. My name is Ruman, I play guitar, and they pretty much already repeated the number twice already, so. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, and that once again is ORC.